Welcome back to our tech. Today we review the Okasu air purifier. So this was sent to me uh, some time back and I think it's called Okasu. But anyway, so this is uh, the impressive $75 air filter. I totally lost the packaging uh, in transit and I still have some of its plastics left and uh, it's it's a very nice little air filter comes in this great uh, off-white finish so it's got all these controls right on top and it's got this nice blue ring which I'm assuming will light up and uh, that's the branding So there's a, uh, there was a user manual included in this and I uh, just was happy to see a nice little book which they've given us and it has some of uh, the features mentioned. Of course it's got a PM 2.5 air filter, uh, air filtering capability which really makes this a good product and uh, the filter, yeah, so it's it's got this four stage filtration system and uh, it's got a primary filter, a HEPA filter, microbial filter, and a carbon filter. So that is awesome. And also to give you some of the specs, uh, runs, in, uh, runs at about 12 volts, uh, DC supply, adapter included, has uh, just three watts of power consumption, can clear up to 172 square feet of uh, room space, uh, supposedly silent at 20, de 20 decibels and uh, has a clean air delivery rate of uh, about 15.8 meter cube per hour so it, it doesn't really look like it can do that much because it's got a volt adapter included here and uh, this is about uh, 2 amps and it looks like it's made of really good quality it has at least uh, 2 meters of wire and the cord is also very easy to use Anyways, so this is easy to set up. It's just got four simple steps. You know, you just have to twist this thing and um, you lift it up and it's going to split into two pieces. Filter is replaceable, goes at the bottom of the unit and once, once installed, you can just uh, twist and lock the unit. So this looks like it weighs less than two kgs overall. And once you open it up, the filter is visible the fan is more like a cpu fan um, and yeah at the bottom let me just get this off so at the bottom of the unit you can uh, again see some branding and uh, some of the specs so yeah, so the air filter, which uh, which really stands out, it's a replaceable one, and four stage filtering available on it. So that's the outside mesh, which takes care of the bigger dust particles. Then there's a HEPA filter, and then there's a carbon based uh, sponge filter. I tried opening it, but it will. So that's how it looks. Pretty cool. It's more like a automobile uh, car air filter. Sometimes that's what it looks like. Anyways, at the bottom of the unit, you will see there are LEDs. There are about three of them. And the power source is actually right at the top. The wiring comes at the edge. So when you lock this unit up, it gets the power from the main unit. And it's really built solid. So let's put this together. So you just drop in the air filter. It's that simple. You just put it in and I'm just trying to see how this works. Yeah, so it's going to pull air from the bottom of the unit. So yeah, so just let's go ahead and fix this back. Once you do that, you know, you 
you get a nice little click which makes you realize that it's locked in place. Okay, coming to the operation of this unit, it's it's very simple. It's just got four buttons on it and it's clearly visible what they do individually. So the power button is touch sensitive compared to the rest of the buttons. Others need a slight nudge and this thing is really quiet. So uh, it's got a 20 decibel sound rating but it's, it's really quiet. So air is sucked in from the bottom and you can see the vents on the surface of the diameter. So that's going to kind of deliver out the cleaner air. And the lights, of course, it's a cosmetic function. So the M button will kind of change the way the lights move. You have a light on off button as well and the fan speed. So there are four fan speeds, so right from zero to four. So overall, you know, the unit looks really, really cool. I mean, when you keep it on a table, it looks really nice, uh, something futuristic. Um, can it actually handle a 172 square feet room? I'm not pretty sure of that, but uh, yeah, it's it does mention that. But it's gonna take a long time to clear such a big room, that's for sure. And uh, in case you're looking to buy this, I'll leave uh, links in the description below. And uh, as always, uh, this is my small review on the air filter. And uh, if you like the video, please do subscribe, hit the like button if you do. Uh, you can leave your comments. I'll be making more videos, videos like these in the future. So please uh, subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.